How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here. Play some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. We're going to be jumping into some 1v1 games here with the man himself with so much strength. We're going 10 strength, baby. 10 strength, Zul. I'm trying to get him to level 25. Obviously, uh, if you guys have been following me for a while, you know that I've been trying to get every single legend to have black colors and to get black colors... You gotta get level 25 with that legend first. I have 40 legends with black colors. My last one was uh, Vector. Very cool uh, that I have Vector Black. I, I'm proud of that. It took me a long time to get him. But now we must focus on some of these cannon legends, guys. When you're playing Zul, you want to pay close attention to the spot dodging. So that you can punish with maximum efficiency. No. You want to get that weapon? No. I have so much power, guys. Nice try. Oh, that one was good. Bye bye, dude. Axe is so strong. Do I need 10 strength? No, but am I happy I have it? Yes. No! Man, I was so close to the three stock. Cool duck. Where you going? You ain't gonna walk through me. Oh, the step back into the cannon to the face. GG, dude, GG. Movement, man. You don't even have to be good. Like, I'm not even good with cannon. I'm terrible with it. I don't know how to use it as well as any other weapon. And yet, if you're good with spacing, that does all the work for you. Because anybody can hit a side sig if it's wide open. You know what I mean? So, you just got to create those opportunities with spacing. Boom. And eventually I'll learn how to do some cannon strings. Like, I'm kind of learning the basics. I'm trying to get better. I need to change this map. Somebody remind me to change this map. I liked it because I thought it was dark and cool. Like, it's night. Ooh, that's different. But now I don't really like it because it's so dark. Oh my! Oh my! We were playing the waiting game and he and neither one of us wanted to wait. Bye. 
Bye bye. We are right back in this. You know why? Because axe is broken. And that's all I need to win. Literally, all I need is axe ground pound. Bye bye. Bye bye. GG dude, he absolutely destroyed me first stock and then I just completely demolished. Oh my goodness. GG dude, GG. So I did a game with Gridiron, did a game with Amethyst. Now let's go Demon Ogre, but I want to give him some better looking weapons. Let's go, ah, uh, let's do the Jade Dragon and for the axe, oh yeah, flash fire baby. And you know what, do I have Skyforge? No, I don't. Skyforge looks really good with this one, but let's just do Charged OG. I like the white axe blade. Looking so clean. Alright, let's see who we got. Gel Holds R2. Gel Holds R2. That's a strange name, but I guess so is Lucian Sword. <laughs> Alright, 3, 2, 1. Bro! Come on, Zol. 10 strength, baby. 10 strength. out your head gel oh man don't poke your head out again Too slow. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. He might have got me there, boys. Yep. Nice, nice ground pound. I actually did make it back, but he, he sealed the deal. I figured I was dead after that one. Look how scared he is. He goes all the way to the edge of the map. Dude. The edge of the map is not your safe place. Okay? The entire map is my safe place. The only place that's safe for you is underneath the stage where you're falling into oblivion. Oh, wrong move, bro. Wrong move. I'm gonna hit you again with that. I'm gonna hit you again with it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it in his head that that claw will be his death. Oh, never mind. Dang it! I wanna kill him with the claw! 
<laughs> well, GG, dude, GG. My, my only advice for him would be be more aggressive. Don't, like, give me the middle of the stage. That's literally giving me an advantage. Don't go to the edge of the stage unless you're pushed there, all right? All right, let's do one more. Uh, let's go... Actually, I got time for two more at least. All right, let's do Arctic Trapper. This one, we gotta go default colors because it just looks so good. So does that cannon. It goes so well with the skin. I just gotta do it. But the axe, we can definitely improve. Let's see. Oh, that one looks amazing. Let's do Final Breath. I think this is a Volkov axe. It might even be his base-like skin axe. But I think for this, Arctic Trapper Zola does great. If this was Fashion Hala, even though it's like basic, kind of, it, you know, there's no special color or anything like that. I would still give this like an A, A minus. It's just such a good looking skin. All right, who am I going against? I didn't even, I didn't even read the name. Three, two, Forged one, one. Zodiac. Wow. All right. Vector too. All right. Fortunately for me, I know how Vector is supposed to work. I just got him to level 25 myself. That was actually a really good move. Most people don't uh, utilize the ground pound that well on the bow. They only do it like... Wow! I did a down light. <coughs> Excuse me. A gravity cancel down light. And he, he was all over it, man. Wrong time to do a neutral sig, bro. Oh, so close. He knew that I was covering that. He tried to get over, but he just couldn't. Shouldn't have done that. What? You think you're gonna slap me? You think you're gonna just do a side air and that's it? Come on, man. At least use an arrow. Why? Oh my goodness, the patience pays off. Oh my! the wall how oh my goodness i can't believe i didn't touch the wall forged zodiac Where's that side sig? I know you want to hit me with that side sig or down sig. No. Alright, GG dude, GG. Alright, we got one more skin to go through, right guys? We are leveling up Zul very quickly with this method though. Look at that. Another 126 XP. Alright, one more game guys. Commander Zul. Uh, I wish I had black colors, but we'll get there. I am so close. Alright, let's go gray. And... Commander Zoli he looks kind of medieval, so let's give him the dragon cannon. And uh, for the axe, uh, let's give him a, a nice medieval looking axe, how about? Hmm. That one wasn't bad. Hmm. 
Choices, choices. By the way, guys, I hope you enjoy the video. If you do, please go ahead and drop a like. It really helps me out. All right, we're gonna go Axe Bladed Multi-Tool. This is one of my favorite. Oh man, look at that gray. The, actu the gray actually looks really good on a lot of skins. I still have so much to learn uh, with Zul and uh, with Cannon in general. Axe is pretty easy, but with Cannon, I, I, need, I need to learn a little bit more. Ooh, going against Narwhal from Velocity. All right. 10 Strength Zul versus Jiro. Looks like a pro Jiro or semi-pro. I don't know. Oh, thank you. Oh! Zul is just a beast! Alright, now he's mad. He's trying to style on me with the unarmed. There's a good KO. Come on, Narwhal. Let's see it. You gotta at least kill me. You gotta win this game. Alright, this is at a tournament. You would lose. He's so nervous. I mean, rightfully so. floating above me you're floating in the perfect hit hitbox for that Oh. GG, dude. GG. I, I, I knew it was probably going to be an easy win when I saw Jiro, because Jiro doesn't have hardly any defense, man. You know what I'm saying? Let me see. Where is he? I think he has... Yeah, normally he only has three defense. I didn't see if he boosted the stat, but even if you have four defense versus 10 strength, and if he took away from defense, yeah, that, that, that yeah, that, that probably did it right there. All right, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please drop a like. Be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. As always, this is Lucian Sword. Take it easy, guys.